hit the thumbs up that's a like then hit subscribe and hit that bell and watch my whole video hey i've created a scene in vr using open brush inspired by the story chicka chicka boom boom by bill martin jr and john archimple anyway i've created the alphabets the coconut tree and some coconuts and we're going to have a great time watch my video i had so much fun making it and i hope that it might inspire some of your younger ones to learn about the alphabet and how to don't forget if you can get the book chicka chicka boom boom fantastic story for kids they love it all right all i need you to do is one more thing just watch the base of my scene i'm working on a green base and then I'm going to start to create my coconut tree. I kind of feel like I'm shooting icing out of these brushes. After the coconut tree, then I'm creating coconuts. I have some that are going to be on the ground and some that are going to be next to the trunk. Starting to work on these leaf shapes and these brushes that I'm using for these leaves are just fantastic. Now here comes the stars of the show, ABC and the rest of the gang. When I first started doing this, I was only going to do the ABC, but how can you do a chicka chicka boom boom and leave out the rest of the alphabet? because all the kids need to learn every single letter. So I created a much larger base for this piece. And then I'm going to integrate everything into that. We'll join the two together. And as you see, I've already added eyes to my ABC but I need to start working on the rest of the alphabet and put them around too. Some foliage, some grass, a little texture. And here comes the rest of the gang. I love this story. And what's even better than the story is the video. starting to put some clouds in the background, but the video has such fantastic music. And I wanna tell you, you wanna get kids to learn something, well, you have to do it in some kind of routine. You gotta make it fun. And if you have a song or a dance or a clap to go with it, they'll learn it. And they'll remember it. And I think what makes Chicka Chicka Boom Boom so wonderful is the actual name. Like, who ever thought of you're going to have a book teaching the ABCs and you're going to call it Chicka Chicka Boom Boom? Even when just reading the book, it's very, very addictive to these kids to say some of the words while you're reading the book. And I almost assign certain parts of the story to them. And I'll point to the class when they're supposed to read a certain part. Oh, I just love my little alphabets. Singing that little chicka chicka boom boom. Now here's a little overhead view. Where you can see my rainbow and see the whole gang of all the alphabets and those that are climbing up the coconut tree you can see some of the coconuts in the tree and some on the ground i just wanted to take a story that's i think very influential especially to the kindergarten child and to make it three-dimensional colorful something that 
they would enjoy seeing to help them on their journey to learn all the letters and to start being readers. Bill Martin Jr. created a fantastic story. I will use it forever in my classroom. And I just wanted to give you and your team props for this book.